Let's talk about something serious. Nuclear weapons. Why is it okay for countries like the United States and Russia to have nuclear weapons but not Iran? Sounds like a double standard, right? Here's the deal. In 1968, a global agreement called the Nuclear Non-Proliferation Treaty, or NPT, was created. It said, only five countries can legally have nuclear weapons, the United States, Russia, China, France, and the United Kingdom. Why? Because they already had nuclear weapons before the treaty started, every other country that signed the treaty agreed not to build nuclear bombs. In return, they could use nuclear technology peacefully, for things like electricity. So, Iran signed that treaty? That means they promised not to make nuclear weapons? But for years, the United States and Israel believe Iran has been secretly working on it. Why does the United States care so much? A few reasons. First, Iran and the United States don't exactly get along. Second, Iran has a rocky relationship with Israel and they've supported groups like Hezbollah and Hamas. Third, if Iran gets nuclear weapons, other countries in the Middle East might want them too. That could start a nuclear arms race. But wait. What about countries like India, Pakistan, and even North Korea? They have nuclear weapons too. And they never signed that treaty. Israel? They've never confirmed it, but everyone pretty much knows they might have them. Here's the truth. There's no fair system. The world's nuclear rules are built on trust, fear, and power, not equality. Countries that already have nuclear weapons want to keep them, and they don't want others, especially enemies, to join the club. So, no it's not really about who deserves nuclear weapons, it's about who the world trusts, and who they're scared of. Crazy, right? Let me know what you think. Should everyone give up their nuclear weapons, or should everyone be allowed to have them? Drop your thoughts below. Follow for more breakdowns like this.